So in life, to be successful, you have to follow rules. In other words, that in every situation, do this, don't do this, uh, focus on this, don't focus on that. Uh, and uh, those are what rules are. They're, they're guidelines to lead you to the best performance and the best possible results and keep doing that you know, consistently better for the entire length of your entrepreneurial career. That's what rules are. One of the things I find really uh, kind of funny in the program is when people see my Colby profile. So uh, those of you who uh, are on the Colby, uh, everybody in Strategic Coach knows about Colby. This is the, for us, probably the single most valuable outside profiling system that we use uh, in Strategic Coach and what it, uh, what the Colby profile, you can just uh, see for yourself, just go to colby.com. Um, it, it, what it does is it very quickly identifies how you take action to get results uh, in, in, you know, in your work and just throughout your life. And um, so my, my Colby, for those who don't know it, is two fact finder, two follow through, 10 quick start and a four implementer. And um, one of the things, the moment that uh, I tell people what my Colby is or they see it written, they said, oh, you must, you must not like rules at all. And I look at them and I said, are you kidding? I said, how long have you been in the program? It's just all rules. And I said, I love rules. You know, I'm a, a you know, you know, but I love my own rules. You know, I, I, I don't love other people's rules. I love my own rules. And they say, well, I don't know how you can be disciplined to your rules. And I said, the reason I'm disciplined to my rules is I don't want to be disciplined to other people's rules. And so uh, every day I'm exploring new territory. I'm creating new possibilities. I'm creating new opportunities. But one of the activities that I do is that I continually tell myself what my own rules are going to be uh, for my performance. And, uh, and so, strangely enough, with this Colby, which a lot of people to be interpret to be almost like a rule breaker, uh, actually, I've turned it into just the opposite, that I'm a profound rule maker. So if you want to be a rule breaker, then you have to be a rule maker. And, uh, it's, uh, and because you can't live without rules, and if you don't have your own rules, guess, who, guess whose rules you're going to follow? You're going to be controlled by other people's rules. And that's really, after all, what entrepreneurism is about, is that you are confident enough uh, of your own abilities that you'll go into the marketplace and you will escape from other people's rules. But the requirement for you to be successful uh, in this jump into the marketplace is for every rule you had when you felt kind of controlled by other people, you have to replace it with a rule of your own. And uh, so th this totally changes a lot of people's attitudes because there's this, you know, I, I consider to be this totally unrealistic notion that I'm an entrepreneur because I can't stand rules. And, uh, and I've seen people who have this attitude and they're continually frustrated and because they don't follow other people's rules but they don't have any rules of their own to guide their behavior, uh, they, they're on a treadmill. They never make any progress and they use up needless energy uh, breaking everybody's rules, including their own. So, uh, you know, you could probably relieve yourself of an enormous amount of personal stress and anxiety and frustration if you just accept the reality is that wherever you are, there's going to be 100% rules. Which percentage are going to be other people's rules and which percentage are going to be yours. And in my case, what I've tried to do is every year out of 100% rules, I've tried to make a higher percentage of the rules be my own rules so that I don't, so that I'm really not controlled by other people's rules. And uh, so nobody ever talks about this. I've never seen any books written about it. I've never seen anyone from the stage ever talk about this. I've never seen any surveys of entrepreneurs actually talk about this, but this ability and the necessity of creating your own rules is perhaps the greatest new habit and skill and attitude that you can have to keep growing for the rest of your life.